So hello then guys, it's Kev here again at Woodland Camping Craft. Now some of you might be uh, surprised to be seeing a camping video coming. Um, I've put a little, couple of videos out just lately but they've been the drone videos. But yes, I am out camping, beach camping. This tradition, um, it is the summer solstice and for my birthday we always, always beach camp. And <coughs> broken back or not, here we are. Um, well, I'm three or four weeks into recovery of having a broken back. Uh, but all the lads said, right, we're still going. You could be sat at home having a beer on the sofa or you can be sat at the beach enjoying the view. Um, and getting out there in the fresh air and everything else. So, and that's what I've done. Everyone's decided that they was going to carry my kit, going to pitch me up, going to set me up. All they have to do is sit here and enjoy it, basically. So massive thanks to all my friends. We're, we're getting out and we're out beach camping. So without further ado, let's roll some B-roll and let's roll some drone footage so you can see where we're at. believe this the very last time I come beach camping I bumped into Steve uh, Frogmoon Wild Camps and Wonders and Paul Prep Nomad and Steve is here again the very last time I come camping I bumped into Steve on the beach and he's here again I can't believe it but hopefully we should have a good night Yeah, so what I thought I'd do for this camp then, considering I'm, I'm a little bit injured, is bring the cart bed. So, I've got the DD4 before up as well, as a shelter. Lily's got a little camp bed that's going to be coming in. Um, I've got adjustable legs to get me nice and even, nice and straight, sort me back out, make sure I'm comfy as well. I just brought a line prop from home, just because... I knew how I wanted to camp, I know I wanted to use the dune at the back and I knew that I wanted that view. So you might have just heard that I was going to do a time lapse with the GoPro but you can't really see on screen. Some lovely colours but the clouds or anything are not really moving so I might get one of the tide coming in or going out. Save the battery power because I just don't think that that's going to... Uh, that's going to do enough to uh, be pretty enough for a video. Last of the sun then, kids are still playing out in the sand which is awesome and why we love beach camping but yeah, last of the sun, nip in the air, extra layers gone on. Hope we get a nice day tomorrow. Okay. 
So, good morning everybody. I had a, an awesome night's sleep in the, uh, in the old cart bed last night. Um, had a pad underneath it as well to insulate me, keep the cold off my back. Everything was great. Wicked night's sleep. Nine in the morning, uh, nine in the morning. I think we went to bed about two. So yeah, good few hours. I've uh, actually just spotted a wild camper on the dunes around the corner. But yeah, bacon. Bacon and coffee, I think. So this is what we're faced with, well you can't see the watch, but it's high tide time <laughs> and normally the tide comes to there where you can see it's damp, that's the high tide mark, uh, that's the high tide, uh, it's going to start re retracting right right now, we don't know what's going on but that, that would be why the sand fire is uh, not very good this year, it all, looks all dried and shriveled, but yeah, I can't believe it, but normally by now the kids are all playing in this. Just where Matty is there, where it gets a bit change of colour. So, whoa, crap. I thought the football was going to hit me right in the chops then. So yeah, God knows. God knows why. Must be something to do with the lunar, the lunar pull. But yeah. High tide is miles away. That's over a mile. With my back, I ain't walking out there to, to get some drone footage, that's for sure. Bit of Aboriginal telephone. <laughs> Go on, hit yourself on the edge just for the camera, man. <laughs> so, good morning, guys. We didn't do a lot of filming yesterday, to be honest, because, well, with my back being ill and everything else there. Uh, wasn't um wasn't too much for me to do. A lot of the people went down to the beach but it was so far out that I couldn't walk down there, so sorry if there's not tons and tons of footage for you. But uh yeah we've had a good day. We're actually gonna go back me and Matty because we're gonna go uh watch the England match. Everyone else is gonna stay for a bit. But we're gonna have a, a slow pack up and uh yeah, hopefully get some breakfast on, a bit of coffee and do some artsy fartsy shots for the intro, I think. That's what my day's going to consist of. <laughs> 